Hi, my name is Brian Berdanier, and I am playing M in our staged reading of Cock. Ludo. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Ludo. Ludo. Hey, hi there. Hi. We're in the middle of interviewing Brian. Oh, hi. <laughs> hi. Hello. <laughs> hi, my name is Zach. Um, I have been a part of TIP for since 2019, and I play the part of John in this play. I agree, it has to be completely right. I mean, he always made me feel like I used to be. Okay, can you introduce yourself? Hi, I'm Kimmy, and I will be playing W. Sorry, I had to think about it for a second. <laughs> I tried to look less feminine. Right. I failed. Okay. Hey. Now we're waiting on Tim to get some refreshments, and we'll get back to this interview when he's done. What is Tim getting? What do you think Tim's gonna get? <laughs> Please don't get a monster. <laughs> <laughs> I like monster. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> well, I don't have a name, which is a bit of frustration to start with. Well, you Nor do you, actually. Nah. You're nameless, I'm nameless. But we're people. We're well, people. And I'm the father. Yes. So I think I've called F. Hello, my time getting here. Tubes! Tube tubes. Hello. What is Cock the Play? What is Cock the Play? Okay. Um, cock the play. <laughs> We've lost my background. Marty, come back. What is cock? What is uh, it? The play, cock? the play. The play. Joan added swiftly. <laughs> yeah, very. Uh, well, cock the play is the story of a couple who have been together for seven years and who are living together and doing that long-term relationship life and one of the two members of this couple cheats on the other and it's sort of the the aftermath of that a uh, very raw I think telling of relationships and and personal identity and kind of the societal pressures that you know are put on people trying to you know define who they are whereas that you know might not be necessary for everybody and i must admit when i first read it i wouldn't have described it as a comedy no, <laughs> at all i agree um, but having said that now i can see elements that can be fun once you read it out loud once you read it out loud and, and yeah and how you perform it uh, so I saw it more as a, well I do see it still, as a, uh, effectively a psychological drama um, and uh, at moments a very intense psychological drama, people putting pressure on each other in particular ways through their character, their words, their personalities um, and so that's how it's fun to see how people react when put under pressure. The, the script does not sort of unfold in chronological order, so one of the toughest things when we're rehearsing individual scenes is to kind of remember where we are in the sort of overarching story. Um, I have little notes before every scene that's like, this is after that one time, but before this other thing. Confusingly, when I first saw F, I thought that was female. Me I thought too. that's the That's why I keep going on to your line. So it took me off on the wrong yeah, track when I started always, yeah, and reading always... it in a feminine voice. But it didn't make much sense. <laughs> and also, like, trying to read through it, always be reading your line. I know. Shit, Shit sorry. I put it wrong. Oh, oh, sorry. <laughs> so the point is, we all know each other's lines yeah, very well. Because we good. set off learning the wrong yes. part. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I love the compass. We're coming through. Come on. But so this is our space. Come on. Come on. Oh, we need to... Ah. Cool. Hi. Staying safe. So, here is our space. <laughs> I don't know if I'm supposed to be introducing, but... It's <laughs> fine. Um, yes, this is where we've been rehearsing. This is where all the magic will take place. And um, we're really excited to have everybody here. Yeah. Have you met Tim in person before? No? Oh, no, yeah, yeah, we have, we have, I think, um, yeah, 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 kind of in the very beginning we met in person, so it's good to see you again. <laughs> uh, and, I mean, I'm 
so much shows. I'm trying to remember. Uh, I've only been in Spring Awakening before that. So, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, maybe Cinderella the first time. Okay, we're going to get you a cake and a shot. All right. So, you guys sit in here. Maybe I'll turn my shirt around. Okay, <laughs> I won't feel bad. Zach so is not hitting me. Turn around, that's all. <laughs> well, no, he's not hitting me. There we go. Ready for a head check. It's been nice to it's been nice to meet you, but it's also <laughs> been nice to actually be in a to be able to sort of generate some of that camaraderie. I think that comes with in-person rehearsals. Get cock. <laughs> <laughs> that was it. <laughs> <laughs> Mic drop. <laughs>